What's good everyone? Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you guys my favorite affordable perfumes. You do not need to be spending over $60 in order to smell like a million bucks. I got you guys with a bunch of recommendations today. I don't even think I've ever included so many recommendations in one video. So I got you guys with a bunch of different brands, celebrity perfumes, a bunch of different things. So yes, let's hop right into it. The two first perfumes I have to show you guys are from a brand called Dossier, and Dossier reproduces high quality luxury perfumes at a fraction of the price. These are beyond amazing, you guys. I cannot even begin to tell you. Dossier has a risk-free system, so you could try out your perfume before totally committing to it. They actually have a 30-day return period, so you could return the unsealed 50 milliliter, send it back, get your full money back, everything. And I think it's perfect because it could be intimidating buying perfumes offline. You don't know what they smell like, and there's many brands that you buy and you can't return. Once you've opened that package, you're done. That's the best part about Dossier is you get to try it before fully committing, which I really appreciate. Each bottle is $39, which is an insane price point because luxury perfumes usually range from about $50 to $280. So the fact that you're getting this for $39 is crazy to me. The quality is so good, you guys. Amazing. This first one is my absolute favorite, and this is actually one of my most complimented perfumes. The amount of compliments I get off this is crazy. This is the Gourmand and Orange Blossom, and this smells similar to La Vies Belle from Lancome, and this stuff, you guys, is insane. Insane. Literally so similar. It's wild. This is a super sweet and warm, intoxicating fragrance. It's great for all times of year, all times of day. You could wear this during the day, at nighttime. Like, it is the sexiest, most wearable, perfect fragrance. The lasting power on this, you guys, is crazy. Like, crazy. Now, the notes are orange blossom, black currant, and hazelnut for the top notes. Middle notes are orris, jasmine, and patchouli. Base notes are praline, vanilla, and tonka bean. Now, this is intoxicating, you guys. It is the most beautiful, warm, sweet floral. You could wear this all times a year. You will be smelling like a million bucks, let me tell you. So stinking good. I'm obsessed with that. Now the next one I have, this is Floriental Vanilla. And this is supposed to smell similar to Black Opium from YSL. Now the top notes are Mandarin Pear, Pink Pepper, and Licorice. Middle notes are jasmine, orange blossom, and the base notes are cedarwood, patchouli, vanilla, and actually coffee, which I do enjoy coffee notes a lot. Now this one is your night out. This is your night out on the town. You want to look good. This is a little black dress and a pair of heels. This is that type of fragrance. This is super sexy and beautiful. Definitely a compliment getter. Moving on to the other fragrances, this is Cloud Musk by Mix Bar. Now, this is amazing. Thank you so much, Rada, for buying this for me. This is about $30. I'm so sorry if you guys hear screaming outside. We have a bunch of kids on my block, but this is insane. Insane how good it is. Super original. I've never smelled anything like this in my life. Definitely a compliment getter. You could wear this all winter all fall long it is something so beautiful if you don't like musky fragrances please don't get turned off by this it is out of this world and the lasting power is amazing now i told you guys i have a lot to show you so i'm not gonna talk about each one a lot a lot but this next one is also from mix bar this is vanilla bourbon amazing you guys know like this was all the internet was talking about in the fragrance community in the winter time this in cloud mask this smells like a vanilla like campfire it is so stinking good the lasting power is great i love mixing this with bonfire bash from bath and body works so yes it is so so good you guys okay moving on this next one is actually a celebrity perfume this is a rebel fleur from rihanna you guys can purchase this offline it is 
so stinking good intoxicating warm sweet sexy it smells like an actual like luxury perfume it is wild to me i'm not a huge fan of the packaging i was i think when i first got it but just the packaging does not give this justice it is so stinking good and it's so long lasting it's wild I'm obsessed with this. This is your night out. Definitely not your daytime fragrance. It is not your hoodie and sweats type fragrance by any means. This is definitely something that you have to dress up with. But I'm obsessed. I also love mixing that with um, Little Black Party Dress, the body cream from Bath & Body Works. That is a great mix. This next one is Miami Glow from JLo. This is probably the top five most original fragrances that I own. It's something that I've never smelled before. Please get your hands on this. The lasting power is wild. It is like a soapy, tropical, fresh fragrance. It's like no other. It's one of my favorite, most complimented perfumes. It's absurd how good this is. I pray that they never take this away online because I will buy 3 billion backups of this. By the way, I love the packaging. It's like so early 2000s. But you guys need this in your life. It, I just can't even begin to go on how good this is. And I love mixing it with um, Agave Papaya Sunset, the lotion. I think that's a beautiful mix. All right, this next one is actually from Target as well. This is called The Blanc from Soli Notes. I know Sam, Samantha Kim here on YouTube, she really loves this stuff. And this is a super nice, aquatic, fresh fragrance that has a good amount of sweetness to it, which I really like. Beautiful the best out the shower fragrance if you guys actually just want to smell like you hopped out of a shower then get this it's great also because it is so affordable if you wanted to wear this to the gym or something you could do that as well it's such a good fragrance you guys and it's so underrated like no one talks about this and i've been loving it for a while now literally since last winter okay this next one is from Jessica Simpson. This is called Fancy. I have the little guy right here. Now, this is a very synthetic, warm, sweet floral. Now, when I say synthetic, I don't mean like, oh, it smells bad. It's just more synthetic smelling. And I think that's why I like it so much. It's just your typical, like, early 2000s warm, sweet gooey fragrance i love this i'm telling you guys like get your hands on it i know you'll be obsessed with this if you like warm sweet fragrances it is beautiful just beautiful and it makes me like feel so girly and good i just really really like this i think this is also going to be perfect for fall and winter if you like sweet stuff just because it's definitely very warm so yes all right moving on this next one is called Sophia from Sophia Vergara. Now, this smells very similar to Coco Mademoiselle, but I actually kind of like this more. I don't know. There's something about this that's just really, really pretty, and it's so long-lasting. I think the difference that I'm trying to think of right now is it's less warm than Coco Mademoiselle. It's a very nice, sweet floral it is definitely just beautiful guys i don't know why i'm so congested today but that's why i'm sounding weird i hope i'm not getting sick but yes this is so stinking good it's not exact exact as chanel coco mademoiselle but if you definitely want to dupe you don't want to spend like the money on that one get this for sure it is so good and it gives off that same vibe so pretty so so pretty this next one you need in your life, you guys. You need it. This is from Sarah Jessica Parker. This is called Lovely. And it is the most beautiful fragrance. It has honeysuckle, I'm pretty sure, in here. I know it has a little bit of lavender as well. Which you don't find in a lot of fragrances. The only other perfume I own that I think the only one that has lavender in it is YSL Libra. But this is better. I like this more than Libra from YSL for sure. Like for sure. It is just fresh. It's beautiful. Like 
it is insanely good i always get so many compliments with this stuff because it's so original and so pretty and just womanly but not like grandma smelly don't take it like that at all just a beautiful original different scent that you've never smelled before it's truly like one of a kind it's beautiful this next one is called glow by jlo so it's not miami glow it's the original glow now again the packaging amazing but this is definitely more of your powdery floral fresh fresh floral but has a powderiness in here i think it is beautiful super clean smelling just absolutely outstanding i really really love this stuff really love this this next perfume do not let the packaging fool you guys this is jovan white musk i could purchase this i could purchase this. what am i saying you guys can purchase this at walmart it is the most beautiful powdery fresh floral and it's interesting these are definitely different this is more powdery than this i would say or maybe they're about the same yeah probably about the same but this definitely packs a punch this is very long lasting very strong now i could see this being one of those that you either love it or you hate it i love this stuff so much you guys like absolutely amazing so good i just feel like i could take on the day i feel super fresh super good it's not one of those nighttime like night out fragrances first of me i love my fresh th ugh, i cannot talk first of me i love my fresh fragrances so i wear fresh fragrances out all the time like when i'm saying out i mean like out at nighttime so yes this is so good the packaging is so bad i, I don't even know like what like what is this they need to change the packaging but i love it this next one is still from jlo and it actually has a t-note in here i'm pretty sure a white t-note stunning i have not worn this in a little bit and i need to because i love this oh so good it literally smells like an expensive tea like you just smell so tasteful and so good oh i'm obsessed this is the best everyday scent like if you need something that's perfect for an everyday type deal this is the way to go for sure no you guys i don't know if i i found it so this is the elizabeth arden green tea perfume oh my gosh i actually got this at kohl's you, could, you guys can find this online a bunch of places but it's literally they're not similar but the same vibe because it has like the main note being tea but this is green tea it is so fresh and so good and like i get so many compliments when i've worn this i have the mini i definitely need to get the big one i think it's like 15 or 20 bucks for the big one i'm not sure but you guys the best out the shower you just want to smell fresh you want to smell good take on your day definitely not your night out but this is your go to work go to school perfect fragrance perfect so anyways you guys it took me so much to not even include more fragrances because i have so many i was going to include the gold rush from paris hilton as well totally forgot to do that until i just saw it by the way thank you so much dossier for sending me over these perfumes i'm in love like obsessed by the way if you guys want to get 10 percent off your order you guys can use my code natalie grace 10 so that will be in the description box below all the information so yes i love you all so very much you mean the absolute world to me and i'm so thankful for you guys seriously like you are my blessings and i cannot begin to thank you enough like you're getting me through this time in my life and you have no idea like your simple comment means the most to me like the world anyways i love you all and i'll see you guys in my next one blessings are on the way